Adamites, welcome to a brand new game on the channel called Super Brothers Sword and Sorcery EP with songs and sounds by Jim Guthrie. Let me just fiddle a bit around with it. Yeah, I played this game yonks ago, uh, but I'm playing it again. I was only 28% of the way through, so I was miles away anyway. Super Brother Sword and Sword EP. It's a, it's a click and... Lad oh, let me do my... Ladies and gentlemen, how's about you tap these two little sil... <coughs> Jesus! Tiny little Jesus. Uh, uh, there you go. Uh, just gonna choke over here. You can also tweet it as well. Our research indicates that social support networks will play a significant positive role in the outcome of Super Brother Sword and Sorcery EP. We're not gonna do that though. Now, the ability to broadcast your findings is a. Oh, yeah, that's fine. For acute soul sickness. Oh, I forgot about that. Typically, it only requires 15 to 30 minutes to complete. Well, that's good, because that's kind of the length we're going for. I'm ready. Let's do this. But yeah, it's all 2D pixelated, but it's it's just really nice. Look at us. There we are. Hey, we've got a little doggy. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, tip-tap. <clears throat> Hi there. Oh. From the war-ravaged steppes of Scythia, we meet a dark-haired girl in a sunlit meadow. To the mountain folk of the Caucasus, she was known as Girl, and she seemed nice. Well, that's good. Hello, girl. You seem nice. What's this up here? Tip-tap. We spied a thingamajig above the iron gate. In the middle is a movable iron gate, but we need a cavernous cave. Oh, no, don't do that. Alright, let's go. Oh, we've got to go back to the path, okay. Look at our reflection, isn't that cool? So yeah, it's entirely just uh, click and point and click. Yeah, point and click, that's the word. Oh yeah, I feel that's how you look around. Let's go down here. Get a little rabbit. Oh, I can zoom out. Ah, we spied a solidly built water with a broad wooden roof. Can we turn the, the handle? Okay, not just yet. Okay. Home's where the hearth is. Oh, that's cool. Let's have a look then. Oh, just gonna. Oh, there was someone out there. Inside the hut, the hearth was familiar, quietly cracking with familiar warmth. What's this? Despite the hut, we spied a little round something or other above the hearth. Seems to be about it for this. Okay, so let's head out then. See, so each one of these is a session. Was this your owner, little one? Let's have a look at this guy. Let's have a chat. Hi there. The wood chopping woodsman chopped wood. Oh no, it's a tongue twister. To the mountain folk of the Caucasus, he was known as Logfeller, and he seemed cool. He does seem cool. Logfeller knew all about our willful errand, and he agreed to lead us up the old road. 
Still, we definitely got the feeling that he wasn't super jazzed about this. Oh dear. That's not good. Hey, little doggy. Fuff, 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 fuff. Alright, let's go then. You, oh, there. <coughs> Choking on that peanut again. Ah, <coughs> whoa. I can, I can hear things. Just not sure what they are. There's something down there. A spider curious looking nest box with an inscription to read tweet and you shall be retweeted. Oh man, I'm remembering. Ooh. Ooh. I am remembering parts of this, but like I said, I only got a, f a little bit of the way through it. Uh, okay. Oh wait, actually, I think he wants us to go that way. Mm. Tear still water. You have to find some dinner here. I'm getting a bit hungry. Tip tap. Yes. What does it say? Scythia, Sumeria, Assyria, and Persia. Ah. Oh. These are all the kingdoms of men. Mingitor is the kingdom of the cloud. I hope I said that right. He's unlocked it. Right, I know I gotta go that way, but there's something else down here. I should have just gone there first, I don't know why I didn't. Yeah, it's quite a it's quite a relaxed <coughs> game. I'm gonna choke, I ate I ate a peanut before I played this. That was a bad idea. <coughs> right, let's go up here. Let's see what we got up here. Uh, pretty much nothing. All right, so let's go through. But yeah, as you can hear, it's all very, very very quiet. Very, very minimalistic. Which is what I liked about it. I think my older brother, he told me to play this. I'm just going to put this on silent. Okay, it's on silent. I thought my phone was on silent. I thought I'd better just check. Alright. Well, up we go then. Up the mountain. There's something rustling in these bushes. Dip, 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 dip. So yes, obviously, all rights reserves to Jim Guthrie, who owns these. What does this do? Aside a stride log bridge on the old road, stood a grim flagpole adorned with blocky looking skulls. Oh. Doesn't look good. Ooh. Ah, oh, here we go. That thing's got three eyes. No, I want to look at this thing. By the side of the elbow, there's a stone carved with a pair of glyphs in the shape of a sword and shield. Oh, cool. Ah, oh, nice. I think I might... I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. I'll just, I will work it out. Okay, so you got to attack when he gets near. There we go. Oh, that's not good. 
Bye then. Bye. Where's the wall? Oh, there you are. Oh, that's us. Sorry. <laughs> Actually, no, I want to go up there. Oh, no, hang on, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. We spied a collection of greys in the thicket to the side of the old road, and we wondered what was up with that. Oh, you're going up there. There we go. I wondered that too, actually, yeah. I think I missed that the first time around, actually. Yeah, I'm fairly certain I did. That's just log fair, I know who that is. Okay, I, sometimes I think I don't click it right. And um, he just stands there. We spied a weather looking nest box that looked kind of like in a face in a creepy way. Yeah, I suppose. Oh. Oh wait, can we can we get down there? Oh we can! Oh I didn't know that. See I missed that again the first time I think I played this. Let's just read this first just in case. On a side path leaning away from the old road was a stone carver that says indecipherable glyphs. In the indecipherable glyphs we spied a series of lunar pictograms. Okay, so I don't know what they're used for yet. I'll see something to do with the moon, maybe. A locked door hidden in the forest underbrush under the old road links up to me at all. I, I missed that the first time. But yeah, we can't do anything with that yet, because obviously I'm assuming we have to be there <coughs> during the night. Possibly, but we'll find out. We will find out. We on our way, Logfella? Cool. Let's, uh... <clears throat> that's, a, that's a big mouth. We spied the solitary grave at the edge of the perilous precipice, and we wondered what was up with that. Your guess is as good as mine, dude. <clears throat> I think we have to refract the sunlight. something I just couldn't want to do. There we go. Does he get it? Oh, he does he? Yeah, he wait. Oh no, it's just light inside him. Oh, he stuck his tongue out. I like the little tip he did there. Yeah! Are oh, you excited, dude? Can I, can I cross now? We had the bridge to... <laughs> We had bridged the chasm and we felt super smart. We told Logfair that we saw the burdensome book of sinister sorcery known as the Megatome. The Megatome lurks somewhere in the haunted darkness beyond the perilous precipice beneath Mingy Tor. Wow, that's quite a lot of tongue twisters. We resolved to go get the Megatome and then get out alive. That's a good plan. No lie, that's a good plan. It's a bit dark in here. But then there's outside to the light. Oh, what is that? Aside a rickety bridge to the grim pole, creepily adorned with an antlered skull. That's never a good sign. These guys clearly don't want to come with us. Trespass. Well, I think we got her. Ooh, are we trespassing? I think we are. 
Oh, oh, here we go. In a subterranean corridor, we spied an ominous statue, but we didn't worry too much about it. I would. I would be worried about that in a fantasy thing. I'd be quite worried. we go. I'm kind of hoping that they're all the same, but we'll, we'll, oh. Let's just check. Let's just see what goes through here. They, they might all lead up to the same one. Oh, no, they don't. Uh, yeah, the three triangle. Let's just see what this goes. <clears throat> hmm. Hmm. Ow. I had two bug bites on my, f oh, right. So they just go around, that's fine. Yeah, I do bug bites on my fingers, they're really annoying. Oh, hang on, what's this thing here? Never mind. So let's have a look at this. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Wait, can I go around the sides here? Oh, oh, no I can't. Yeah, it's very clever, it's just an endless cycle of going round and round. Very clever. Ooh. That doesn't look, oh that's the Megatome! And there's the three triangles. Oh, oh. Found the Mega and cast two bone hands. We found our sword stone in its sheath. But, thank you. However, I got a feeling you're not. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, boy. To run! I meant to run! <laughs> yeah, I meant to run. Oh, yeah, of course, because it said trespass, doesn't it? Yeah, time to go. Dude, I'm so sorry. I mean, I know it's your book and all. But, uh. Yeah, you know, I, I, I just kind of had to pinch it. I'm so sorry. Turn around. Oh yeah, down those stairs quickly. That's it. Dip, 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 Oh, crap, do we really have to fight him? Oh, it's the statue! I have to fight the statue! Oh, there you go. I ain't gonna attack you, what are you talking about, you nuts? Ooh, 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 it's a bit of a learning curve. down. Cool. Uh, now time to go. Because he's probably still a little bit annoyed that uh, that we stole his book. I'm not going to lie. I mean, I can understand that, you know, we, we stole his book, but at the same time, you know, it just had to be done. Right, let's get out of the room. Let's go. Bit dark in here, I'm not gonna lie. Bit spoopy. Yeah. Oh, I wasn't even out yet. Oh. 
Hey, look, fella. I found a book. Oh, that's not good. Oh, it's just his tongue going away. That's good. Nope, that's not good. Unless that's the evil or... Do. Oh, it's that wolf again. That thing follows us around. That's probably not a good sign. Let's get out of here. We have retrieved the Megatone Logfield. It was 100% ready to move it to... To move it, move it to the safety of its lodgings. We said it's a gathering thunderstorm, and yet a little song began in our heart. Cool. Let's get out of here. It's like, we're just going to leave Logfella behind. Just run! Run as quickly as you can! Oh, 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 there's the wolf. Dude, as much fun as I'm sure that would be, um... Logfella, you got to move faster than that, mate. we gotta, we got to get you out of here. There's a thunderstorm, it's already starting to rain, and we got to get back to your house. Oh yeah, I forgot you can zoom. There you go. Mm. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Run, 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 run. Well, the dog's gonna get there before us, so that's alright. Doggy will be safe. That's cool. Oh, what's happening? Ah, oh, thunderstorm. That's cool. I like thunderstorms. I do. Oh, they're just so much fun. Run, dude! Oh, look, Phil waits for us though. I forgot about that. I have forgotten literally everything about this game. Oh, why'd you not? Mmm, I'm getting a bit concerned there that I was gonna get locked in. You didn't want to look at that. Oh, he is locking the door. Okay, cool. He's locking the door and locking the wolf inside it. You stay there. You're not a good nice wolf. You're, you're a bit of a meanie poo. And you're stuck. So that's fine. So that's why. Yeah, time to go. I think we're coming up to the end of the first session, actually. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, it's girl. Whoop, whoop. Yeah. So they all see. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's the end of the first session. Yeah, that was in the first session. We got the Megatone, we are the smartest. Yeah, that's cool. And yeah, it literally took about 25 minutes. So you've awoken the Deathless Spectre, oh boy, who slumbered in the darks beneath me, Tor. Yikes. Look at his little dealing hands. Consequently, a sinister thunderstorm looms, and the lovely people who live in the stone heart are a little heartbroken. I know, it's my fault. I'm a little bit... Yeah. The upshot is that you got the burdensome book known as the Megatome. In our next session, we will discuss its strange purpose. Our research shows that the prolonged exposure to the myth... Mythopoetic psychosmology of the SNS, if you can have reverse side effects. So now that you completed session one, how about we take a little break? We'll be right here when you're ready for session two. That is amazing. That's so cool! Ugh. Yeah, that is where we will leave it. That's amazing! So yes, that's where we'll leave it for this episode. We'll return this next week. So, yes, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll be back tomorrow with a brand new video. But until then, you guys, stay atomic. And I'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye.